Showers and thunderstorms are ongoing across our state this Wednesday morning and rain has just started at our studios in West Des Moines. We've got showers rolling through the metro. There is nothing severe. The storms are a little more intense, a little more noisy across north central and northern Iowa. Here is the rain moving into the Des Moines metro right now. Some light to moderate showers beginning in Ankeny, Grimes, Johnston, and also down through West Des Moines and Waukee. We've had a couple bolts of lightning and a few rumbles of thunder, but again, severe weather is not a concern this morning. There are some lighter and more moderate showers to our south. It's pretty light from Indianola all the way down through Osceola and Lucas County, but there is more steady rain across central and southern Decatur County, and then the thunderstorms are ongoing to our north from Ogden to north of Jefferson through Gallery, Fort Dodge, Rockwell City, and into Pocahontas. Again, these storms are weakening a little bit. There is some thunder and lightning, so it may wake you up early early here on this Wednesday morning. Just be careful on your commute. Make sure you have the headlights on and your windshield wipers as well. There is a lot of cloud cover overhead and there will be off and on showers through the day. So those two things will keep us on the cooler side throughout our Wednesday. 73 the temperature by noon and then we only make it to the mid and upper 70s later on today. I'll keep a chance for scattered showers and storms in the forecast even into the afternoon. Our future cast keeps pretty widespread rain around through 9 and 10 a.m. It'll start to get a little bit lighter around lunchtime, but still somewhat steady to the east and southeast. Then by the afternoon, it becomes more hit or miss. We will see spotty downpours with occasional thunder and lightning. The best chance of that will be to our southeast. And then I think by 6 or 7 p.m., we will be drying out, which bodes well for the Iowa State Fair Parade this evening. And tomorrow looks like a really great day for day one of the State Fair. Partly cloudy, temperatures climbing into the mid 80s, so be prepared for some warmth. And then tomorrow late at night is when our next chance for thunderstorms will move in. It develops after 10 p.m. in northwest Iowa on Thursday night, moves into central Iowa, after midnight, there will be a broken line of showers and storms, a few of which may be strong to severe, but I think it'll be out of here by 7 or 8 o'clock on Friday morning, and then the rest of our Friday likely will be dry. Now look at the warm-up we've got coming our way. Friday, 89. Should be good for the fair, though. 88 the high on Saturday. Sunday, more showers and storms in the forecast by the afternoon and evening, but then we get a rare treat on Monday with highs only in the upper 70s.